hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Vivian Bella if you're new to my channel you're very much welcome if you're my subscriber welcome back so today I'm not gonna deal it all around because we do not have that kind of time I got six red lipsticks six red drugstore lipsticks that I'm gonna swatch for you guys on my lips so you can decide according to your skin tone what you think is best for you this one goes for light skin tones and dark skin tones so i'm gonna just get snatched for you and tomorrow you know or for any other occasion you can decide what's perfect for your skin tone and yes so without further ado let's get right into the video i just wanted to show you guys the perfect red lipstick for valentine's day or any other occasion <laughs> i'm getting crazy anyway guys kindly subscribe to my channel i would feel really appreciate that leave a comment like click the notification bell so you do not miss any of my videos and yes without further ado let's get right into the video so i guess you can find all these lipsticks in your local drugstore um like the german brands i'm not sure if you can find them in another country but um these this 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 brands like l'oreal paris or max factor or yeah these ones you can find them even in the states i guess or whatever you are in your local drugstore probably you can find them so yes i will link all these lipsticks in the description box below you if you want them just click the link below and you're gonna get them okay so guys let's start right away if you see me looking on the side it's because i have a mirror on the side i have to see what i'm doing so yeah okay let's go ahead so i guess i'm gonna start with this max factor this is the shade ruby tuesday 075 i've been itching to put this product on my lips because <laughs> it's so cute it's so damn cute i'm trying these lipsticks guys with you for the first time as well so if it looks too weird sorry <laughs> so yeah i'm not gonna use any lip liners i just want to use it the way it is so you can see the true color of the lipstick without mixing it with any um lip liners so let's see how this ruby tuesday looks It's kind of glossy. I feel like it has some orangey type of vibe. I don't know, some orangey undertone. That is definitely kind. It's definitely glossy. Was it because I had some gloss on my lips? I don't know. How do you guys like this lipstick? It's not a deep red, but it's cute. It's kind of cute. Don't you think? I would wear this anytime. Yeah. On to the next. So second, I'm going to try these um, Trended Up Ultra Matte Lipstick. This is very exciting because it's really matte, like it looks really matte. So let's try this on. Oh, 
it says matte but i don't feel matte Actually, it looks velvety. I was expecting some kind of velvety texture. But I actually like this red. Guys, don't use lipstick like me. <laughs> I'm using it in all directions. <laughs> use the one side that is sliced off, eh? Don't use like me, like. Mmm. <laughs> I actually love this red. Mmm. You see, it's not shining. It's it's matte, but it's not matte matte to dry your lips. So this is a perfect. This is really a perfect. Um, in between yeah it's perfect in the sense that it's actually matte so it shouldn't transfer i don't i'm not sure if it transfers well it does it transfers but it's actually very it's not shiny i love this actually i love this texture Cute, eh? <laughs> okay, on to the next. I said we're not gonna deal with it today, so I got all these lipsticks from um, DM, Drogery Markt, drugstore, local drugstore in Germany. So, on to so the next. I'm gonna try this um, matte lipstick, non transfer from Catrice so this is the natural vegan lipstick I've been I have told you about like I've mentioned it and it says it's highly pigmented liquid lipstick with matte finish lightweight feeling non-transfer yeah and it's vegan so oh it says you can also find it in New York made in frankfurt you can find it in new york as well so the americans watching actually i i recommend this brand i have used it a few times for not this lipstick particular lipstick but i've used their their products some few of their products before and it's vegan so it's one good for the environment and two it's not as harmful to your lips so let's go ahead and try it this is how it looks like okay let's just go on and put it on the lips the lips are looking pinky aren't they <laughs> Oh, this is a true red. Wow. I really, really love these uh, liquid lipsticks. It has a one which makes it so 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 easy to apply oops makes it so easy to apply oh this I love
Oh! <laughs> Looks like we're gonna mess this up. So I guess they say it's non-transfer, so I guess I've got to apply it and wait it for dry, to dry. Mm, so soft to the lips. Mm. Mm, guys, I love this. Mm, mm, mm. This what we're talking about. This what we're talking about. Hmm? This is pretty. So pretty. It's nicely, nicely, slowly but nicely drying up. And you can lay it up. You can put on another layer. And another layer. Another layer. But I love this. Oh, I love this. Actually, I do love this. Look at how nicely it's drying up. Hmm. But don't put on too many layers because it looks like it could get tacky. Like, like sticky, sticky. <laughs> okay, guys. We love this one, don't we? On to the next. So next, I'm gonna take Next is going to be the L'Oreal Paris lipstick. This is the L'Oreal Paris Colorish Colorish Matte. Number 347 Hot Rouge. So let's just go ahead and apply this. Has a really, really creamy texture. This one also looks like it has an orange e kind of undertone. How do you like this one, guys? This one would look great with a with a with a nice dark cherry um, lip liner, right? But it feels very creamy. I'm not sure if it transfers but when i used it last time it did not become it did not become like matte matte like it could transfer it could transfer so so far the only one of these lipsticks that was matte and non-transfer was the catrice one so i've tried to stay for a few minutes just to see if it's going to dry up a little bit more, but doesn't look like it. But it's very nice, creamy texture. And it's more of a velvety texture as well. I don't think it dries up more than this. And it's very, very transparent. Last but not least, it's going to be Infamous Milibachi 
number 46. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and use it. This one, like, this is my to go lipstick. Like, this is the OG, okay? So this is um, also a kind of liquid lipstick and it's also matte. I'm just gonna put it on. I think this shade looks great on dark skin. I did a video I did a video with this lipstick and the video is called how to do the perfect ombre the perfect red ombre lips so it's gonna pop up right here so if you wanna watch it you can go ahead and watch it um, I did like the perfect ombre red lips. So I used this lipstick on that video. So you can go ahead and watch it if you like. I also leave it in the description box below. Just literally gone out of my way. I think I'm actually tired. <laughs> it's midnight. It's midnight over here. Uh, I had to do this video, so <laughs> I can't believe this. How tired can I be that I'm keeping on going over the <sighs> this is how you make your lips look fuller if you want a video about this how to make your lips look fuller let me know in the comment section because there's some people who actually have naturally very tiny 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 lips if you want to know how to make your lips look fuller leave a comment drop a comment down below leave a like and i'll do a video about that okay. So also this lipstick, this is a matte, non-transfer lipstick. This is the one lipstick I could for sure say, like, it's perfect for dark skin tone. It works for me. I'm sure it will work for you as well, but it's perfect for dark skin tone. As you can see. <laughs> I'm snatched. <laughs> anyway, guys, so yeah, let's do a transfer test. It's minimum to none, and it's not yet dry. Like when it dries, it's really dry. Like we ain't transferring nothing nothing like when it's dry it's really dry so yep yeah. on to the next on to the next on to the next so guys this is gonna be the last lipstick oh this lipstick i've just used now was milibachi number 46 that's how it looks like this is from Nuba. The company is called Nuba. N -O -N -O -U -B -A. So this next one is from L'Oreal Paris. That's how it looks like. And it's called I Don't Want Thought In. It's like, do you take blah 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 to be your lovely baby? Blah blah blah. And you're like, I don't. This is the I don't lipstick. Do you guys think or do you guys see like it looks orangey as well? 
I don't know. I feel like it's kind of orange. I don't know if I took the wrong shade. Let's see how it looks though. Let's see how it looks on, 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 on the lips. I have a feeling this is orange. Terrified. Oh my gosh, guys. I think this is actually orange. Is it red or is it orange? I don't know. Well, this feels matte. Do you guys this, think this color is red or is orange? <laughs> Do you think it's red? I think it's red with the... I don't know. Like... What do you guys think? Do you think it's red? Well, it looks red on my lips though. Red with a huge hint of orange. <laughs> what do you think? So, this is how the L'Oreal Paris shade I don't look like. It's dry now. It's a bit dry now. A bit of transfer not too much I think it's red yes it's actually red and I love it so thank you so much guys this brings us to the end of the video thank you for watching and if you're not subscribed kindly subscribe leave a comment below like click the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos and yes have a beautiful Valentine's or Galentine's or Valentine's and I will see you in my next video thank you bye